Jeff Ferro's on the Hot Topics. Today, let's talk women. Woohoo! Thanks for tuning in, Jeff Ferro's on the Hot Topics. And today, <coughs> Concho's excited about it. Concho's my dog. Hi, dog. <coughs> I know. Hang on. I'll play with you later. I gotta talk about women. I know you like women too, huh? Just stop. Just give me a moment. Ay ay ay. Got your place. Alright, where was I? Oh, talking about women. So you women out there. Why do you vote Democrat? The Democrats, especially in this last midterms, when they're what, 2022 elections, a lot of people voted Democrat. And I'm kind of confused on why, but that's for another issue. But they're, they're campaigning on, hey, you have to vote for the Democrats because they're all about women's rights to abortion. I'm like, all right. That's a very emotional thing, and, and I guess some people are going to say they're pro-life, pro-abortion, whatever. But I want to look at it a little differently. If the Democrats are all pro-abortion about women's right to have an abortion, what about the women's right to compete in women's sports? Or to use a bathroom with some privacy, or even... A beauty pageant. The Democrats support a biological man using a woman's restroom, declaring himself as a transgender. Now, I'm not against the transgender thing. To each their own. I really don't care. But I'm curious. If they support women so much, why are they allowing a biological man to compete in a woman's sports. A biological man to even compete in a woman's beauty pageant. And what's even weirder is the biological man is transgender. In some cases, they're winning the pageant. <laughs> that really blows my mind. <laughs> they're saying in a pageant, if it's truly done fair, they're saying that a, a man makes a prettier woman than a woman makes a... What? That doesn't even make sense. How can... <laughs> How can a man be a better looking woman? Cacho? No. So that doesn't even make sense. A man makes a prettier woman than a woman makes a prettier woman? That doesn't even make sense. So, so what they're saying is a man is a better looking woman than a woman is. How's that possible? <laughs> okay. Um, that's a huge insult to women right off the bat. To even, to even allow them to compete in a beauty pageant and to allow a biological man to even compete in a woman's sports. Now, if they had gone through the sexual reassignment surgery and all that, and it's happened like 10, 20 years ago, okay, maybe I can understand it now because, because all the hormones and all this that they've been taking has started, you know, genetically changed their body. So maybe I get that, but I still don't get it. Some of some of these that, that I'm, I, I read about and I see, it's these people are still teenagers or they're in their early twenties. I'm like they're still technically a man, but because they identify as a woman, they get to compete in a woman's sport. That makes that's dumb. And then that's an insult to women. And then the same thing with the woman's restroom. Oh my gosh. 
this one blows my mind totally. You were, have a woman who uses a restroom. Now, I don't go to a women's restroom, so I don't know, but I'm assuming that every stall has, like, walls and a door. They might not. I don't know. I haven't been in one since high school. <laughs> so, so, I guess they kind of have privacy there, but they're in an area that, to me, should be exclusive women. And you're allowing a man to walk in there who's claiming that they're a transgender to use the same restroom. Now, I get it that each stall may have those door, the door and the walls, but not only is that insulting to women, but it's, oh my gosh, it's just, God, what's the words I'm looking for? Just degrading women. And yet, you women still support for the Democrats. So let me get this straight. Some women, not all of you, but some women are voting for the Democrat because, oh, they'll give you the right to an abortion. But they're saying that you have to go to the bathroom with a man. <laughs> so the abortion is more important than that. And they're saying that other women compete in, in the beauty pageant. Well, they have to compete against men. And men are going to get denied because if you don't pick the man, then you are transphobic. <laughs> It's just dumb. It's stupid. Can't you see this? You know, women, put your comments down below what you think of it. And I think it's a huge insult to the women's rights, to the women movement, to women, period. And women should be pissed off. And women should vote Republican, regardless of the abortion thing. Just because you can always go back. And really, the, the, the whole abortion thing... That is, to me, it's actually minor when compared to all this other stuff. All this other stuff affects every single woman when you go to the restroom. At least the abortion thing doesn't affect every single woman. It only affects those who kind of wanted it. But if it's a state's right issue, then just go to the state that has the abortion if you really want one. Now, granted, I guess maybe transportation might be a problem. But it seems like these Democrat-run states are willing to even pay for the transportation now. You get the best of both worlds. So, why, on a federal level at least, why are you voting for Dem Democrat? You should be voting Republican across the board so that you can get women's rights back. But that's just my opinion. I'm Jeff Farrows on the Hot Topics. See you. Bye. Have fun.